Hey guys, um, today's video, if you might have noticed on top the title, it's um, actually in memory of a friend who passed away recently. Um, her name's Faiza. She was, um, we basically got to know each other through an online um, blogging community. There's a bunch of us in Singapore, which is a pretty tight knit group actually. Um, we have a, there's a blogging platform called onsugar.com. So there's a couple of us who um, always get together um, for like Christmas. You know, we have a huge gathering, about 20 to 25 of us, and we have, um, you know, Christmas swap. Or sometimes we just um, get together for like a couple of us, for, you know, just for lunch, for tea time, stuff like that. So uh, basically, Faiza is one of us um, beauty bloggers at On Sugar. Really lovely girl, um, very, very sweet. I wanted to do a video for her because she um, passed away a couple of days ago. It was really very, very sudden. Um, quite a big shock to many of us. Um, it happened, I think, about two to three days back in the morning when she just suddenly passed away. Um, I wanted to do this video for her because, um, as you all know, sugar pill cosmetics are one of my absolute favorites. I love sugar pill so much. I do so many looks with sugar pill. And um, when I remembered Faiza, I remembered her because the first time I actually got my hands on my sugar pill eyeshadows was because she had ordered them for me. So I remember I was so excited, you know, and she came and passed them to me and she even gave me the little sticker inside and I was so happy to have them. So um, every time I use my sugar pill eyeshadows, I'm definitely going to be thinking of Isa. Uh, we might not have been too close when we, we probably met like a handful of times only, but she's a really sweet, very lovely girl. And um, I wanted to do a look with my sugar pill eyeshadows in memory of Isa. So really very simple look actually. Um, I wanted something that it's very wearable which is just golden purple so um i really hope you guys like this and um this one's for you Pfizer. okay so i'm gonna start off first with um, applying my two eyeshadow bases um uh, starting off with aqua cream the reason why i use two is um simply because um i find a lot of eyeshadow bases don't really stay on my just below my brow bone I, I don't know, maybe I perspire quite a bit there. So, um, aqua cream, however, stays on amazingly well. So, I use the aqua cream for just above the crease. It's really, really amazing because it's waterproof, smudge proof, uh, crease proof. So, it's practically the best. But because it's not very, very um, strong in terms of... Like I want it to be matte, it's more of a shimmer tone. So that's why I use the MAC Paint Pot next. Just take a little bit. And this just goes on my lid. Especially at the inner corners because that's where um, I'm going to be applying the gold. So I'm going to start off with um, Goldilocks. It's a Goldilocks pigment by Sugar Pill. And it's like I mentioned in my previous video, it's an amazing color. It's super pretty, very, very bright. I'm going to use a flat brush and I'm going to just dab it on, like just press it onto my lid, the inner corners mostly. I've already applied some loose powder to my under eye, so you might want to do that to catch any fallouts. Okay, now I'm just applying it to half because I'm going to blend the purple in later, so not too far out, just halfway through. And then I'm going to go for a different brush. I'm going to go for this brush, something that's a bit more fluffy because I want to lightly blend it into the crease. So just pick up a little bit and just blend it into the crease here lightly and you can blend it out again later at the end right then I'm going to go for purple of course one of my favorites from Sugar Pill amazing color and um, I'm using my 217 MAC brush you can get the same one at Sigma and I'm just really loading it on and just applying it on Check out how strong the colors are. It's amazing, really. This is why I love Sugar Pill so much. The colors are so strong. And I'm just applying it to the remainder of my lid and into the crease. But as I go up towards the crease, I want to slightly 
uh, make it a bit more lighter, nothing too strong. Um, I'm going to go back for the blending brush I used for the gold. I'm going to pick up a little bit more gold. Not too much. And just blend this out. And then I'm going to go for my um, highlight brush. And I'm just going to use my regular highlight. Just to soften up that area a little bit. So far so good, really simple, just two steps basically. And I'm gonna do my brows and my eyelashes and I'll be right back. Okay, um, I basically stuck on my lashes and it's not completely dry yet so I'm gonna wait a bit. Um, fill in my brows and just did a basic uh, eyeliner on top. And then I'm gonna go for a pencil liner and I'm gonna do my lower lash line. And this one is just not my favorite um, Dior pencil liner. And I'm gonna start at the outer corner and then just bring it in. But as I bring it in, I made it a little bit more thinner. So you can see this is where I add the gold. So not too much all the way in. But your waterline, you can line it all the way. And then I'm gonna go for um, the flat brush again and pick up some of the Goldilocks. And this is just going um, just only at the lower lash. This is the inner corners here. Okay. And then for the remainder, I've already lined it with black. So that's going to be a base for the purple eyeshadow. So I'm going back for the same sugar pill purple using a smudger brush. Just applying it to the lower lash line on top of the black so it becomes a slightly darker color because you've got a black base okay I'm gonna curl the lashes and apply some mascara bit of the lower lashes okay and then I'm gonna go for my lip liner this is um stripped down by MAC and just filling in the hole for um, underplay by MAC it's a very nice nudish lip color and then I'm gonna to top it off with lots of gloss this is the um, Rachel K plumping lip gloss which is really amazing I love minty lip glosses it's just so yummy on the lips And that's it, really simple look. Um, like, I, like I said before, this is um, in memory of Pfizer. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.